where we're celebrating all of our jewelry designers. And we're launching our Designer Jewelry Gallery event by featuring all new items from Robert Lee Morris. This is an event price that goes away at the end of the day. $36.42 is your easy pay, which also goes away at the end of the day. And your very first look at this solid open back moon cuff in your choice of colors of bronze. Bronzo Italia lovers, you already recognize the rose bronze, but it's also available in the gold, which is gold through and through, and in the white, that's the one that I am wearing. Small, average, and large are available. You're enjoying that same price and easy pay across the board. And here it is again, just that celebration mm. of the metal and the brilliance yeah. that you can have. And the power that you have when you're wearing something that doesn't need to be fussed with at all. It, right. it just is by itself mm -hmm. a tour de force. Well said, it's so true. And I say that all the time, that sometimes if you pare things down to its beautiful basics, mm -hmm. it speaks more volumes than something that's more ornate or, right. or scroll work yeah, or I've always, covered in gemstones. And always said. Now the beauty oh. of this thing and, and all the cuffs that are on the show are that they have been made, finally, <laughs> <laughs> ovalized. So, I mean, I've been after them for years. Please, ovalize the cuffs. Because when they are in an oval shape, they do not flip they around. They do not turn. Because our wrists are primarily oval. And so very few people Robert's have round, about. round wrists. No. So when you put this on, it may feel a little bit big, but it's not mm. going to flip. Exactly. And so it's, it's a very good size, one size fits all, sort of. You know what I mean? Right. You've got your large, medium, and small, mm -hmm. well, there it, it's like I could wear all three probably. That's true, but they're all going to stay balanced. Like yeah. it's, it, it sounds weird when we're saying it, but it's right. absolutely true. Right. It's just genius in its design. Do not wait if you want that rose. Uh, oh, oh, okay, so actually only average in the rose is available, and that is it. As has kind of been the case with a lot of the items in the show, sizes go quickly, or they mm -hmm. lose entirely their inventories, and boy, oh boy, you just had to do it, right? Because it looks fabulous with that elongated ring. That, let's do some math here. The ring, $58 and change. The easy pay on the cuff, $36 and change. So you've barely broken, what, $90 to get this look home that looks like you're wearing a million bucks. I mean, it's just fabulous. Yeah, that would be like a $1,000 in And silver, right? Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. Oh, gosh. And only these, let's go back to that bronze story. Tarnish resistant, nickel free, about as carefree and maintenance free as jewelry can possibly get. And this will just show you not just the quality of white bronze in particular, but what Robert has done. When you take a look at this up close, you can see the reflection of our entire studio. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you wonder, why haven't we done this before? Thank why did you. we why wait not, all these years? Robert? Well, because there is this thing that real jewelry is supposed to be made of real silver or gold. Well, get real. I mean, you can't yeah, make jewelry that. that looks like this and have it be affordable. It'll just sit in the in a box or it won't sell. Right. So what, what that's Only not half making, a dozen people can get their hands yeah, on it. Yeah, it's not, not making right. me happy. <laughs> I wanted to make jewelry for more people mm. than less people. Right. So this is this is really what drove me to it. Now what we're gonna do is show you at the bottom of our screen our availability guide. And all I really see I see a whole lot of red, uh, particularly in that gold tone, if that's the one that you're waiting on. Waiting is no longer a luxury that we really have, particularly in the rose and in the yellow. What a glorious shot. You see Robert over there <laughs> and the studios and there's our monitors right there. Mm -hmm. I mean, this is the brilliance and the beauty and why Robert feels so passionately that we really kind of should have been doing this for a while, yeah, right? No. But I'm glad to save it for, oh, for now. Oh, look at that. And look at the dimension on this and how it just curves yeah. and then angles up again. It's funny how a piece like this can be as inviting as one that has, oh, look at this detail mm -hmm, and this scroll work mm -hmm. and this floral design and all these facets and everything, and there's, those are beautiful too. But something like this can be as inviting. If you're walking through a gallery of painted artwork and you see the very, very simple pieces with just a few hues in them, mm -hmm. it draws you in and it becomes something that's contemplative and you start to think internally. Right. You don't realize that about pieces like this until you own them.
if you're already a lover of Robert's pieces, then you're sitting at home going like this. Right, we know. <laughs> right? yeah. Preaching to the choir. Yes, we are. Yeah. I suspect but we the, are. But the fact that you have less to look at, that it's more mysterious, it becomes more mysterious. Yes, it's true. You can't, you keep looking at it wondering, what is it that keeps getting Speaking me so excited? Yeah. And it's the part of it, I'll help you, ex <laughs> because I know after the, all these years, there's a, a ridge that happens at the mm -hmm. edge of the, uh, right here from the corner, I mean the ending, mm. to here, there's a dip. And that dip looks like there's something Just underneath pushing right. as if this were made of, of like rubber or, or mm. flesh and that literally a muscle is coming up and stretching the skin. So it gives it that, that very organic um, movement right. and feeling. Right, movement. Well, I'm gonna cut in here and let you know what we have remaining because it's not a lot. In the rows, I have a half dozen in the average, and, that, <laughs> and that's it. In the white, fewer than two dozen in the small, four dozen in the average, half dozen in the large, and that is it. Wow. In the yellow, we have one dozen in the average, and about four of you will get to enjoy the large <laughs> in the yellow, and that is it. So now really is your opportunity, your time to go to the phones or to qvc.com. Couple of reminders though about its availability, not just in quantities, but when we talk about affordability. Getting this home for $36.42 as part of our easy pay opportunity will go away at the end of the day. Whatever remains at the end of the day, which I suspect will be zero. Only day this month that we have the easy pay opportunity and an event price. This is really where we go, thank you for bringing us this brand new mm -hmm. line. And you really get to celebrate this entire event and a celebration of brand new pieces, a brand new line, a brand new look, and a rediscovery of Robert Lee Morris's pieces, which all the while harken back to the passions and the styles that you were creating decades ago. In the beginning, mm -hmm. really. I mean, that's why this, well, when, when we get to the ring, I'll explain the alpha. Oh, I can't wait for but that But we're ring. talking about early, early work. Right. Reinvented and tweaked. Mm hmm Everything old is new again, kind of thing, but you rediscover it. Yeah. And, and the skills that you acquire over time then manifest them. And, you and, know, in and seven, 1978, I was getting coverage in Vogue and Harper's mm -hmm. Bazaar on cuffs that looked just mm -hmm. like this. Right. And so if you, <laughs> and that's the thing, I'm <laughs> sure why so many people keep coming back to you too. Trends come and go. The, rens, the rose, by the way, is mm -hmm. now gone. Trends come and go and we all love them, right? We get excited about them. The pieces that you know you'll be passing on to your kids are the exciting ones, but often the ones that you expect to cost more, right? It makes sense. You're going to get more use out of them. This comes home for $36.42 mm -hmm. and you'll enjoy it for your entire life. And likely your daughter and granddaughter will enjoy it as well because bronze is a strong, a sturdy, a durable, a maintenance-free metal. It's, we still dig up um, archeological <laughs> finds and <laughs> bronze. Polish them up. <laughs> and it's it. bronze yeah. that we're finding. <laughs> and they're every bit as wearable, right? And right. often every bit as bold, right? It's funny how mm. these bolder pieces, they stand the test of time. And like I said, the trends come and go and you always come back to pieces like this. And it doesn't turn your skin green. Thank you. Yeah, <laughs> copper. I was wearing a copper bracelet all day today, and it was turning it's my arm green. green. And I thought, well, that's not well, a nice look. <laughs> but this doesn't do that. Even though it's primarily made of copper, mm -hmm. it's the alloy mix that keeps it from actually turning your skin green. Right. Thank the Thank Lord for that. Just a, and like I said, the beautiful side benefit is that it's affordable at yeah. the same time. And um, we didn't really talk about the fact that this is, you know, like these are bolder looks, but this is not your special occasion piece. This is every single day. Right. This is no matter right. what you're wearing. Yeah. You're wearing it to work, you're wearing this it to is, lunch. This is day wear. Yes. And depending on how you dress at night, and you, mm -hmm. you could put a pair of those peephole cuffs on, and you're looking like um, you're going to the Selena Costume does. Institute. Right. Um, okay, so only the average now remains in the gold tone and very, very few of those as well. Um, and remember, we've already lost that rose. One of a few pieces in our show that we do have available in all three colors of bronze. So if you're loving the, um, you know, the yellow that we're seeing all the way through, the white, which is so clean and white and mm -hmm. brilliant. I mean, gosh, even white gold often when you see it out in retail is murky and muddy well, and this is so icy clean. White gold actually is usually plated with right. rhodium because mm -hmm. white gold itself is not very pretty. It's not very brilliant. No. Three dozen only in the white in average, half dozen in the small in the white and that's it. Only the average remains.